<laughs> All right, once again, happy afternoon, everybody. Happy Monday, and welcome to episode 174 of the On Air Advocate. We're at the On Air Advocate. We look to provide education, support, and empowerment for all of those with different abilities, mental and medical illnesses, and their caregivers. For those of you who may not know me, my name is Tammy Flynn, and I am the host and producer of the On Air Advocate. And I am super excited if you are here joining us this afternoon or whether you are catching this on the replay. Now, as always, if you think that this could be helpful or fun for anyone in your network, please hit the share button right now while you are watching this and share the love with others. So with that, as you guys know, we are in our We're All In This Together series because we're all in this thing together, right? <laughs> Everyone in America um, right now. And so we have decided that with Functional Fitness, twice a week, we're going to get on here. And I was ex really excited about all the people who joined us last week um, and do a 10 to 15 minute fun, functional, adaptive workout. So with that, I want everybody who's here with us to kind of introduce themselves quick. I'm Marcus. I'm her son. <laughs> Thank you. And he's, he's going to be working out too today. And then Amanda, can you introduce your, your business, all that good stuff? Hi, I'm Amanda. Um, I'm the owner of Functional Fitness. Um, my goal is to make fitness functional for everyone. Um, and I have a couple of helpers here today. This is Wesley. Um, he is six months old. And I am six. <laughs> And Wesley just wanted to come on and say hi because he's cute and everybody sees a cute little baby face today. <laughs> he would be a good workout like this, right? He is. Yeah. yeah. Right. <laughs> As well. Now, one of the things, Amanda, that we talked about last time for people who didn't catch it and, and Miss Faith was on last time with us as well, is utilizing things that are in your cabinets, right? You know, things that we have last time we yeah. did. Absolutely. Um, our workouts that we are going to do on here, I'm only using things that are found around your home. Right. So last time we used vegetable cans, we used some water bottles. Um, this time you said like a milk jug or yeah. a big... milk jug. Or... Um, you can also use water <laughs> bottles such as these. The dog's getting into it too. Um, do you want to go let her out? Um, we were going to use water bottles like these as well. These are about um, one pound each. And then the water jug is a little over eight pounds. Oh, also, that's a good way. We'll be using, it is a good way, right? You can get a good workout with that. Right. Um, we'll also be using our couch. I have a bench here. You can't see it, but um, my husband will be moving the on. There we go. Instead of using a workout bench, you can use your couch. Oh, you can use okay. your couch. Or a bench. You're kind of breaking up just a tiny yeah. bit. So you're frozen. There you are. You're back to not being frozen. <laughs> yes. <laughs> um, so I know last time we started with arms, and, and this is, you know, functional and adaptive for anyone. So, you know, liking to use, obviously, the stuff that's at our homes. Um, for weight wise, but you don't even have to use any weights, right? With some of the things we're doing. Yeah. You absolutely do not have to use any weights. Um, I'm just going to show you a few things that you can do and you can add the weight, such as the water bottles, um, if you'd like, but you absolutely don't have to, you'll still get a good workout without the weight. So. Okay. So what are we starting with today with our arms? Can you, again, smile. You want the audience to feel like you want to work out. <laughs> Be happy, Marcus. Oh, that a smile. So we're going to start with kickboxing again. That should make okay. you smile, Marcus, right? What are we I love kickboxing because, because it's nice having cardio. All right, this might get Hold a little on. awkward on Hold your on. live We're stream. switching seats. It might get a little awkward for just a second here. All right, all right, there we did it. Sorry about that, folks. We got to give him more arm room. He is a whole foot less taller than me. <laughs> it's okay if it's awkward. It's 2020. We're all good. <laughs> all right. Back up a little bit. Back up a little bit. All right. Okay. Let's get rolling, Amanda. Everybody at home. Let's get going. You can put these in your hands and use them as weights for this workout. But today we're going to start with a jab, a cross, and a weave. Then a jab, a cross, and a weave. Jab, cross, weave, jab, 
cross, weave, jab. Cross, weave, jab. Cross, weave, jab. Cross, weave. We're gonna pick it up right here, okay? We're gonna go a little bit faster. Ready? Jab, cross, weave, jab, cross, weave, jab, cross, weave, jab, cross, weave, jab, cross, jab, cross, weave, jab, cross, weave, jab, weave, jab, cross, weave, jab, cross, weave, jab, cross, weave, jab, cross, weave. Good, keep it going. You got it. Really pull that belly button to your spine. Get your abs a little workout in here. All right, readjust if you need to. Good, let's give it three more. Two, one. Good, now we're gonna take our water bottles and we're gonna go high, low hook. High, low hook. We're gonna stay on the right side, okay? Ready? And high, low, high, low, high, low, high, low. Low, good, let's pick it up, ready? Five, four, three, two, let's go fast. High, low, high, low, high, low, high, low, high, low. Hit it, Marcus. Good, keep going. Good. Woo, I shouldn't have grabbed these five pound weights. <laughs> right? <laughs> it's a good workout. Keep it going. I'm gonna count you down, then we're gonna switch sides right away. Five, four, three, two. Left hand, high, low, high, low. Good, keep it going. Good, Marcus. <laughs> Good, get it. Bring up the elbow. Get that elbow up. <laughs> way to go, keep it going. Good. Woo, feel that burn? Five, four, we got it. Three, two, one, good. Now the next move, we're gonna do a squat with a press. Okay, you can use your water bottles like this, or if you want a little bit more weight, you can use your milk jug. Base gonna demonstrate if you're sitting, then you can just, you can crunch and press, okay? I'm going to squat. Press, I would just leave it. Squat and press. Good. Good. So, Faith, you're just going up and down, right? Yeah, it's just With crunching your belly when it comes down. Good, let's do five, four, three, two, one. Good. Now we're gonna take our water bottles or milk jugs and put them down. Faith, hang on to that. Faith's gonna demonstrate how to do a push up off of the bench, which you can do a push up off of the couch. If you're in a chair, take your water bottles and have them here. And you're just gonna go, oops, this way. You're gonna go out and in, squeezing those shoulder blades to your spine, okay? Ooh. I'm gonna demonstrate, no, I'm gonna tip it. A push up off of the bench. Ready? We're going to see if we can do 10. 10, 9, 8, good faith, 7, 6, 5, <laughs> 3, look at my feet, 2, 1, good. Now we're going to flip it over and we're going to do a tricep dip off of the bench. So you're going to go down and up, keeping your elbows in. Faith is gonna go back with the water bottles and forward. Ready? 10, nine, good. Eight, seven, six, five, four, whoo, three, two, one, good. Back on that bench. Now we're gonna have our hands up again and we're gonna go Right side, jab, jab, hook, duck, 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 good job, hook, He's got to perform me. <laughs> duck, good, 
Jab, jab. Can you go in slow motion, Amanda? Go in slow motion. Jab, 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 hook, duck. Yep. Jab, jab, hook, hook, duck. Jab, 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 hook, hook, duck. And people should be trying to keep that other hand up, right? Yep, the hand that you're not using should always be up covering your face. Jab, jab, hook, duck. I'm gonna do it slow this last time, and then we're gonna pick it up. Ready? Jab, jab, hook, duck. Now we're gonna pick it up. Jab, jab, hook, duck. Jab, jab, hook, duck. Jab, jab, hook, duck. Jab, jab, hook, duck. I'm gonna count you down, and then we're gonna switch sides. Five, four, three, we got this, two, go Marcus, one, switch sides, jab, hook, jab, hook, duck, jab, jab, hook, duck, jab, jab, hook, duck, jab, jab, hook, duck, good, keep it going, keep going, you feel awkward good. on this side for me, huh? Hook. Yeah, our yeah. little chase we're in here makes it a little harder. Duck, yeah. Good job, Faith. Hook, duck, jab, jab, 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 hook, duck. I'm gonna count you down. Ready? Five, four, three. You got this. Two, one. Good. Now take your water bottles. Side to side. Side to side. Good. Keep it going. This is a little bit of ab work. Good. Down. Sink it down. Good job, Marcus. Slow down. Yep. The slower you go when you work out, the better. When you're lifting weights, the slower you go, the harder that makes that muscle move. <laughs> you got the water bottles. Yeah. Yeah. Faith wants a harder workout. Good. Let's count. Step it up. You can also use. The water jug, if you'd like, a little bit of a harder workout. Five, There's some room. four, three, two, one. Good. And rest. Good job. Woo <laughs> quick and easy, right? Maybe not easy, but quick. <laughs> People can do this. How many sets would you say? So doing three sets of each? Three sets. If you can do 10 repetitions, so 10 times, three sets of each, that would be great. So today, can you just review, can you just go backwards through slow, a couple things so people want to continue doing this at home that you just did? Absolutely. So for kickboxing, truly, um, you can do any kind of punch movement that you want to do. Um, you just make sure that you have a stop point and that um, you pull back hard. Okay, you don't want to just be like this because then you're not going to get a workout. You want to pull, push it out and pull it back hard. Um, so today for um, the kickboxing part, we did a jab, cross, and we did a weave. And then a jab, cross, and a weave. Okay, that was the first part. Try and do that for one minute. Okay, and then we did a high, low hook. And we just um, kept going right here. High, low, and bringing that elbow up is important to remember. And then we switched sides. Um, and then we did the, right? Oh, the milk jug, sorry. Milk jug squat and press. So it's a squat. And then just bring it all the way above your head, bringing those arms to your ears. Squat, press. Good. And or then a. Do this if you're sitting. Yep. yep. If you're sitting, yep. Yep. Good job, Faith. And then the other thing I wanted to um, mention as well is sometimes it's difficult to even do a push-up off of a bench or a couch. So the other alternative to do it is um, off of a wall. I'm going to demonstrate that just really quick, Tammy. Okay. Um, I'm going to try and find a wall here. Right there. I think you can turn it. See if you can turn it. Guess my paper. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, so you're gonna just put your hands on the wall, okay? And depending on 
feet are, the closer your feet are to the wall, the easier it's gonna be, and the further away your feet are, the harder it's gonna be. So if you find your spot where you're comfortable, and then just go in and back out, in and back out. You okay, that's another you froze on your wall. You froze on your wall. You can do it, can you okay. do it again? You froze. Just yep. can you see? Yep. Now it's moving. Yep. Just go down mm -hmm. and up, down and up. Perfect. And just remember, if your feet are closer, it's going to be a little bit easier. The further out your feet are, the harder it's going to be. Okay? Easy. So we did hard. So we did 10 push ups and then a tricep dip. Let's go ahead and do that. The tricep dip is just hands on the edge of your couch and then just go down and up, keeping those elbows in. But if you're sitting down, go like Or like you were doing, Faith, right? Yep, so if you're sitting, you want to go, but you want to keep your elbows still. The pivot point will be in the elbow when you go back, okay? So it'll go look like this, okay? You just want to squeeze the back of your arm when you come out like this. <laughs> All right, well, we will be back again on Wednesday, same time, same bat channel, right? Miss, yeah. are you with us too on Wednesday? Yep, yeah. I think so. All right, yeah. perfect. Well, thank you guys again for bringing us some health and fitness during this time. I hope thank that you. everybody um, who has started joining us, join us again on Wednesday so we can get fit together, stay healthy, yeah. stay moving um, through all of it. Any, any positive words? What's your positive word of the day, Faith? Um, be creative. Be creative. Be creative. Good. What's your and have Linda? <laughs> Have fun, you know, this is something we're all in together. So being creative and having fun with it, that there's nothing we can do about it. We're stuck inside. So be creative and have fun and keep moving. There you go. Do you want to leave us with any parting words? Um, stay young and stay fit. Stay young yeah. and stay fit. All right, we, we might need to work on some other skincare things for that in a different type of episode for, for us, but. <laughs> We're, we're gonna do that and everyone, we are all in this together. Thank you so much for joining us. If you guys wanna know more about the On Air Advocate or the other things that are coming up, head on over to onairadvocate.com and you can find all of our resources and help right there. Until then, tonight, don't miss out at five o'clock Eastern Standard Time. We are gonna have Nicole um, who is on with, she's a CP warrior, an amazing advocate for cerebral palsy. And this is Cerebral Palsy Awareness Month. So that will be at 5 p.m. Central Standard Time. She'll be chatting with us. And then tonight we are doing impact um, coronavirus with two of our favorite doctors, um, Dr. Rochester and Dr. Zarina. Um, we'll be on tonight at 8 p.m. Central Standard Time. Um, so make sure that you join us then. Until then, until next time, functional fitness and you guys. We'll see you on Wednesday. Bye. Thank you, guys. Stay fit. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.